Hola, buenos días, YouTube. Mi nombre es Mark. Hoy estamos volando a Cordoba, en Argentina. Muy bien. Hola. I told you you were going to pick some Spanish, huh? Yeah. Today I'm going to show you how to insert a vertical nav waypoint and also how to change the vertical target if you want to descend at a different rate than the standard uh, rate that it sets in. So let's go over to the MFD and I'll show you how to do that. All right. I'm going to delete this guy. Yeah. All right. So I'm going to go down to a long track offset. I'm going to key in, uh, we're going to do five nautical miles. Enter. And it's going to ask us our altitude. So we're going to put in the 3,500. Remember, it goes in in hundreds, so it's just 3.5. That's our 35. We're going to hit enter. And now we've got that fix, five nautical miles before Cordoba. And our top of descent point right there. So there's also a current VNAV profile box. And that's what we're going to go down. The, v, the vertical speed target right now is 400 feet per minute. I'm going to go down and change that. Uh, let's change it to 600 for fun. So I'm just going to dial to 600 feet, and that's going to change the angle as well. And that also changes your top of descent point. So you can see if when we were at 400 before, we were about three minutes out from our top of descent. I moved to 600, and obviously the top of descent gets slightly farther away. Uh, but you can adjust that based on what you need. Um, for altitude, weather, all that sort of thing. So, all right, guys, I hope that was helpful. And make sure you fly safe. Like us on Facebook, facebook.com slash Northstar Arrow. And make sure to share the video. I appreciate it, guys. Thanks.